It's the Joel Shit Show featuring Joel Shit. Hi, welcome to the Joel Shit Show. I'm your host, Joel Shit. So they said on the news this morning that my city, San Jose, is considering getting rid of bottled water in their government buildings. Like the people that work in city hall or city council meetings or the mayor's office or whatever. Anything that my tax dollars pay for, basically because they want to replace them with, you know, water coolers. Sometimes when technology advances, it's not always an advancement in society, and that's the point that they're making. Yes, water bottles are recyclable, but people don't usually recycle them. The reason why so many bottles get recycled is because the homeless take care of it for us when they dig through the trash, because they can get money for them. For every little bottle of water, we pay eight cents uh, deposit on them. And it's te technically not a deposit, because if it were a deposit, you could take it back to the store where you bought it, and they'd give you the money. That's what they used to do with the 16-ounce Coke bottles back when I was a kid, and before then. And uh, they don't do that anymore. I remember they had this giant bin in one part of the store, and uh, 10 cents a bottle, too. So, like, the six-pack of Coke would go on sale for 88 cents, my mom would pay $1.48. But when you looked on the receipt, there'd be a minus 60 underneath it, because every time she'd buy six bottles of Coke, she'd return six bottles of Coke, well, Diet Coke. And so then there was this giant repository with the six packs of bottles, and I just don't think it must have smelled very good, because my mom always rinsed hers out, but I'm sure a lot of people didn't, just like when people recycle their tin cans, which really aren't made out of tin, incidentally. Uh, I know that people don't rinse those out first, because, eh, victimless crime. Right, then we pay people $15 an hour to clean them out and sort them. So you're paying for it, you're just not doing it. So anyway, uh, the bottles are, it's up for proposal, it hasn't been decided yet, but uh, to, and also the water in the jugs is, you know, fine too, and honestly, you know, 30 years ago we didn't really have bottled water. 20 years ago we hardly had bottled water. My dad was a pioneer because he would buy one gallon jugs of Calistoga water at the store because he was so paranoid about the Fairchild thing that you know, is making our water so bad and stuff. But actually, San Jose's water is so clean that for the longest time we didn't even have to chlorinate it. I think we have to chlorinate it again now, but still, it's some of the cleanest water in the area. But, you know, my dad gets paranoid easy. I drink tap water all the time, and that should tell you exactly how fine it is, because we all know how normal I am. But uh, it'll be interesting to see. Usually San Jose doesn't do the groundbreaking city council changes, you know, that's usually San Francisco or Berkeley or Belmont or something, but, you know, maybe this time we'll be the trendsetter. That's all the time we have for today. Visit us on the web at joelshitshow.com. Email joel at joelshitshow.com.